There's no way he's living. Oh! Hello everybody, welcome back from the episode of the Pokemon Red Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we uh, beat uh, the Pokemon Mansion and Cinnabar Island. Or, or, uh, well, we basically did beat the whole thing. Uh, we did Pokemon Mansion and we beat Blaine. So there you go. Uh, this time we're going to be taking on Giovanni. And we're going to be taking on Blue. And, uh, or not Blue, Sheffrey. Yes, yeah, Sheffrey. Uh, we'll be fighting him again. And we'll see what we do from there. I didn't heal? What the fuck? Am I heartless? What the hell? <laughs> I'm a bad trainer. I'm a bad trainer. Fuck. Whatever. I guess Dog I guess, yeah, Hentai Man can be the first Pokemon. Speaking of Hentai Man, he's the Electric Fire Kingler with Thunderbolts, Flamethrower, Surf, and Cut. Uh, we got Dog Meat, the Ghost Rock type. Uh, Arcanine with Nightshade, Jump Kick, Wing Attack, and Confuse Ray. We got Daryl the Golduck, uh, normal type, with Stomp, Swift, Horn Drill, and Swords Dance. We got Strippo, the electric normal type Sea King, with Thunderbolt, Thunder, Fire Punch, and Soft Boiled. Uh, we got Quamar, our, uh, ri our Psychic Ice type right on, with Psychic Ice Beam, Strength, and Dig. And finally, we got Bukaki, our starter. Our Grass Flying type Muck with Razor Leaf, Fly, Ice Punch, and Leech Seed. So there you go. So anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to fly over to Viridian City and uh, heal. Now I'm pretty sure you do need the secret key in order to get in there. So meh. First of all, we're going to heal. Also, if you can tell by the, total, <laughs> the, 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 the sound of my voice, I picked up a bit of a cold. But uh, I'm going to fight through it because... Why wouldn't I? I'm not an asshole. Okay, I might be a bit of an asshole. Anyway, do I have any items that I can sell off? Nope. Nope, this is all I got. Okay, whatever. Dang. Alright, whatever. We got those hyper potions. We got the hyper potions, it's fine. Hyper potions, we are good. We are fucking good. And I think if we have enough time after uh, Giovanni and uh, Sheffrey then we might be able to uh, maybe go down to the power plant because the power plant is an easier dungeon than uh, Seafoam Islands and get a legendary Pokemon. So there you go. Anyway, welcome to Giovanni's Gym. It's a weird place. Anyway, uh, I'm trying to remember the order as I go. Okay, hold on. All right, we're gonna speed up through these pads. You didn't have to deal with this during the uh, rocket hideout, because I didn't go to the rocket hideout in this playthrough. And that's special. I don't need that. You know what? We're gonna sell it off right now. I don't know why I would want to sell it off now, considering the fact that, you know, it, it's so freaking useless. It's the only item in that gym. I may as well just serve its purpose now, which is to get me more money. Money, money, money. And plus, I'm going to use one of my two Master Balls on the Legend, which should be quite entertaining. So, you know, depends on what it is. Uh, I looked through some of the footage, and I believe Articuno is normal type. Zapdos, I think, is part electric. And then uh, Moltres is still fire. And then Mewtwo is rock type. So I think I'll either want uh, Moltres, Mewtwo, or Zapdos. But I guess, yeah, I guess Articuno would be the weakest legend. Or Mew, because I don't know what type Mew is. Anyway, do I want to go through this long way where there's three trainers, or should I... I'll find out however many trainers I feel comfortable with. Hey, you must be running out of steam by now! You're the first person I've talked to. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Cool trainer, okay. Did that. It's weak to flying. And I'm not using my flying mode. Fortunately, though, it's part bug, so I can just light it on fire. Yeah, the only way I'm going to be able to learn all the... Remember all these Pokemon types is to literally watch my old series, like... Or the older episodes, like you guys are watching this series. That's the only way I'm going to be remembering these typings, is by watching this series along with you guys. Alright, so... Ponyta and Rapid Ash are fire type. Then I don't... Wait, that's probably just... I don't... I ran out of gas. 
Oh, he said I ran out of steam. What the fuck? Makes sense. Oh, I'm working myself into a rage. So you're me. <laughs> it's me. Lo and behold, it's me. A black belt for a performer. Not a black belt. He's not a black belt. He wants to be a performer. Clefairy, huh? Let's hit it with a thunderbolt. Thunderbolt! Is this electric? Light screen. Well, you know what? If you're a special attacker, I can cut you. Arr. Even with hentai man's shit attack, it still kills. Oh, look, it's a Krabby. Krabby! It's father and son. Except, oh, would it be primary electric? Nah. I don't know. Let's throw a surf at it see what happens. Oh, wow. Okay. So, there you go. It's dead. Fantastic. Morg! Okay. There you go. Also, I made a stupid Pokemon and I. We make wonderful music together. You're a juggler, aren't you? Oh, no, you're a tamer. A biker. Ooh, Bellsprout. A level 43 Bellsprout. That's interesting. Sit with a Thunderbolt. Don't resist. Don't resist! There you go. I'm talky now. I'm friggin' tacky from Soul Calibur. I love Soul Calibur. Soul Calibur 6 better be good. What am I saying? I mean, I, I... Whatever. I don't care. The truly talented win with style. I mean... I guess? I don't know. Alright, another cool trick. Star you! Isn't Star you electro type? Or no, is it actually water type? Let's throw a Thunderbolt at it and see what happens. Alright, neutral. Oh, that one shot, though! Wow, Hentai Man will not level up. It's weird. Oh, it's my grip! Yeah, don't lose that whip now, otherwise you'll be sorely mistaken. Sorely disappointed. I'm the Karate King! Your fate rests with me! I thought the other guy was the Karate King in the dojo. Did, did he run away? Was the fighting dojo a sham? It must have been because of what happened in uh, Gold and Silver. Whatever, we've got an Omastar, which means we just throw a flamethrower at it and it dies. Okay. Fuck you, Omastar. Wow. Alright, there you go. Okay, I have to use Haunter, that's a fighting type, meaning uh, we're going to go Dog Meat, because Dog Meat has Wing Attack. <laughs> With that, I drop, I drop the man into the flames. I drop the man to the flames. Uh, Star you, uh, let's keep Dog Meat in. Certainly a star you couldn't do that much damage. Alright, here we go. Oh! Okay. Well, I'm not ground type. Let's put Nightshade down here. Because I feel like uh, Nightshade's only good for encounters at this point. Uh, let's go for a jump kick. Oh, wow, it's weak to jump kick. Okay. Well then. Ain't that something. Ah, oh, yeah. So I think Star You might be Ice type. I think that's my that's my logic right now. Might be Ice type. <laughs> Why would you need that? All right. Uh, I'm just gonna go down here try to scope some things out. So I think there's uh, I think I get a choice a 50 50 between two trainers, but I only need to fight one of them in order to get to Giovanni. So I'm just gonna fight the one after the guy I just fought, and then uh do that. Uh, we're gonna stop. I'm gonna stick dog meat in the front of the party and then put hentai man where stripo is. And at that point, we're only gonna use those three. Uh, Sheffrey's ace is level 53, which the only way that could be scary is if that's a powerful Pokemon, which are very few and far between in this game. Like, there's only a couple Pokemon that I really don't like in this ROM so far. Alright. Speed up. Fuck. Okay, wait. I can't go this way yet. Hold on. Gotta go up here first. Okay. There. 
Now I can skip up up here. Oh, you can just go to Giovanni right from here. Okay. Why would you have this whole segment if you can just do that thing? I'll fight this kid because I want to. Verdi and Jim was close for a long time, but now our leader is back. Yay! Did Giovanni tell you guys that you were part of an evil organization? I mean, they must know. They have whips and stuff. Oh, no. Wasn't this thing an earthquake? Oh, God. Uh, I'm gonna go to Bukaki. I know this is a bad... I know that I shouldn't be doing this, but I just... Oh, God. Oh, God, please, no. What the fuck? Okay, this is bad. Okay, so it's ice type. Uh, I'm gonna go to Strippo? I mean, at this point, if I lose Strippo, I don't care that much. Ah! It's too expendable. It's too expendable. Okay, Strippo can definitely take another one. But if he pulls out that Earthquake, then I'm fucked. Okay, we killed it. Oh, it was a crit. Okay. Whew! Probably my best choice probably would have just gotten to be just going to Giovanni. Okay, Kadabra? I don't care about you, I'm just gonna hit you with a thunder. There we go, okay. There's Strippo. I'm sorry I called you expendable. It's just... I mean, to be honest, if anybody had to take the bullet for the team, I'd want it to be Strippo. Because anybody else would just be too valuable. Okay. I could have soft-boiled again, but... Bukaki definitely needs the friggin' Hyper Potion. He definitely, does, he definitely needs that. Okay, Giovanni. Let us get our eighth and final gym badge. Should I save first? I'm gonna save. Because only you can prevent lost save data. 178 in-game hours. Look at that. Welcome to a randomizer, folks. Whoa! This is my hideout. I plan to resurrect Team Rocket here. But you have caught me again. So be it. This time, I am not holding back. Once more, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Uh, no you're not. You are not. Statistically, you just aren't. <laughs> okay. Scarlet sent out Vaporeon. I don't remember Vaporeon's type. Wasn't it ghost? I feel like it was ghost type. Or was it normal type, actually? Fuck you in the ass. Fine, I'm gonna go for a jump kick. Okay, so it is a ghost. I, I crashed for one damage. One, one damage. Oh, and we get to level up, dog meat. You're so good. Weezing. I still have no idea what Weezing's type is. I have no idea what Weezing's type is. Didn't I catch one? I don't... Or is this electric? Oh, boy. Uh... Okay. Whatever. Let's fire punch it. What are you? A guard spec. Alright, let's heal with a soft boiled. So there's a mission. Okay. I mean, if we just keep stalling like this, I mean, he'll kill himself. I mean, especially if it crits. Oh, it missed. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in for a fire punch. Should have gone for a thunderbolt now that I think about it. Oh, a crit. Submission. Okay, so that's gonna... Yeah, it's not gonna do very much damage unless it crits me. So I'm just gonna stall this guy <laughs> until he's dead. <laughs> Which, yeah, it's a stupid strategy, but... I mean, what else do you think is gonna work? I mean, it basically lets Strippo not die at all. This is the one that's gonna crit. Oh no, it didn't crit ever. Okay. I go, Cubone. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight a Cubone. Oh, 44 Cubone. Oh wow, it's weak to fire. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. There you go. Nine tails. E. 
feel like you're water type. It, I'm not. I'm not gonna risk any type horse shit. The only risk if going into Daryl is if you're a fighting type. Uh, you know what? Get out of my face. Fuck. Focus energy. You give me another chance. Fuck. Disable. Are you gonna disable it? No. <laughs> Disables random in this game. Fuck. Okay. If you just suck... Okay, you know what, Ninetales? Just keep sucking. Skull Bash. <laughs> you know what, Daryl? I'm glad. That was honestly the safest option. Wow. Okay, we only have one option for this thing. Which is Kumar. Because it's quad weak to ground. The thing is, this thing's speedy, isn't it? Oh my god! Kumar's gone. He's gone. He's dead. There's no way. There's no way he's living. Oh! Shoulda grinded! What the fuck? Okay, well, uh, there goes Kumar. Uh, shit. There goes my strength HM, too. Fuck, what do I do now? Okay, um... Shit, man. That's a good one to Daryl. Stomp this thing into oblivion. Yes! Thank God! <laughs> what the fuck? Ha, that was truly an intense fight. You have won. Has proof? Here's the Earth Badge. I got the Earth Badge. The Earth Badge makes Pokemon of any level obey. It is evidence of your mastery as a Pokemon trainer. With it, you can enter the Pokemon League. It is my gift for your Pokemon League challenge. I got 20, TM27. <laughs> Come on! I just lost my Rhydon! Man. And I was liking him, too. Like, he was truly an underdog. I do have to say. Damn it, I knew that Kingler was gonna be faster. I just no didn't know, didn't think he was gonna have Fire Blast. So there you go. You can blame me partially for that, but at the same time. No, that's all me. That that's all me. Just fuck, man. There you go. Alright, well, there you go. So now the game's saved, so I can't do anything. Uh huh. What the heck is Shallow? It's a Pidgey. I could. Oh, God, that moveset. Uh. Electric type Clefairy? I don't care. You're the Flareon. You're the gosh dang, uh. Thing. Firefighting. Run Kick. Acid Armor. Fire Punch. Flamethrower. What are your stats? I just don't want to like duplicating these types. I don't like duplicating. I don't like doing that. Porunga's grass can't use that very well. And anti smokies fire normal. Which is very, you know, not useful at all. And then a lone boner is the Marowak. Just grass type, so I don't care. Mega Drain's in this game. Okay. So are we just gonna go for uh, five members? That's what I'm gonna have to do at this point, is just go for five members and then see what happens. You know, if... So yeah, this, this first box really does not have anything for me. Literally nothing. So yeah, we're just gonna change boxes and go right back. So if I lose, that's it, it's game over. I I truly do believe that if I lose if I lose the the current team I have now, I'm fucked. There's nothing I can do. Unless I spend hours and hours and hours just grinding up a whole new team. In vain. Okay. I, here's what I'm gonna do. Okay. I'm gonna go through 
and try to get the legend encounter first. Let's put Daryl down in front. Because I don't want to fight Sheffrey quite yet. I'm not going to go through Seafoam Islands. Seafoam Islands will just consume way too much time. Wait, where am I going? What? So what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm so horrible at this game. What the f what am I doing? It's down here, not over there. You f I'm a moron. I'm so stupid. I suck. All right, at least hentai man's not dead. So I can fuck you. Okay, I'm literally using the two HMs I need for this area. All right, we're going to defeat this girl. Oh god damn it. Hold on. Oh son of a Oh my god. That was a bad idea. Okay. Whatever. TM forty. TM forty is Clamp. Whatever. I don't care. I'm not gonna fight you. You have to go up. Oh no, you can just go over here. So you have to fight this guy. Okay. Oh, I thought you had to fight that girl. Okay, never mind. Alright, so that was Route 9. This is Route 10. Which means I'm gonna get a water encounter no matter what, so fuck the grass. We're getting a hentai man. We're gonna surf all the way down. And I could have just gone down to heal at the Pokemon Center, but you know what? I'm a man for living on the edge. Isn't there a super nerd down here that battles you? Yeah. Fuck him. <laughs> so this is the power plant. Now the legends are level 50 in this game. They're not level 70. So if you think I'm just gonna go in here and then I'm gonna die, it's not gonna happen. Alright, so we're going to pull out dog meat so that we can nightshade stuff, because we get a regular power plant encounter. And then, I don't know if I want to count the Voltorbs. A protein? Yes, we can buy more potions. Alright, so our power plant encounter is... A Nido Queen! I'm perfectly okay with this. I'm perfectly fine. So there you go. Nightshade, let's nightshade it up. I know it has more than 51 health. Yeah. Psybe! Might be Psychic type. I mean, honestly, the more Psychic types, the better. The Psychic types actually can serve me well. Alright, Pokeball, no, this is not gonna catch. Yeah. Petal! Oh, please, no. Okay. Oh, there we go, we caught it. Yay! Uh. There you go. Neo cleans the drill Pokemon. Its hard scales provide strong protection. It uses its hefty bulk to execute powerful moves. Okay, well, if you remember Pokemon uh, Ruby and Sapphire, I think? Either Ruby and Sapphire or Emerald. We had a Neo Queen named Jugs, and we can check it right now. It's pure ghost type with double team Psybeam Nightshade and Petal Dance. Okay, if. Uh, dog meat bites the dust, which I don't want to happen, then... Yeah, this thing has pretty even stats. I could raise up jugs. I mean, it's a... Oh, but it's a moonstone evo, so... I'm not sure if it... I don't know. Alright, it seems like Needle Queen's the only thing you can find in here, so... I'm gonna put up a map. I'm gonna put up a Super Repel. Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna put up a Super Repel, and if we bump into a Voltorb, then we'll just counter count that as one static encounter, which I'm pretty sure this one is. Yeah. So these, I think, just are the same thing over and over. A Pidgeot. Okay, well, wow, level 40? Shit, I'm gonna pick that up just because of its level. Okay. 
Problem is, if it's a type I'm weak to, that it can do a whole fuckload of damage. Okay, never mind. Alright, well, its defense greatly grows. Okay. Amnesia. Wow, it can raise its special and its defense. On its own will. Okay, whatever. I don't care. Pidgeot has been caught. Yay! Pidgeot's the bird Pokemon. When hunting, it skims the surface of water at high speed to pick off unwary prey such as Magikarp. Okay. Well, seeing how we have Shorty already, uh... Swoop in like a falcon. You know what? I remember as a kid, I would always name my Pidgeys Falconator. I have no clue why I named them Falconator, but I did. So there you go. If we bump into another Voltorb, then fuck. Or actually just run away from it. Yeah, that's what I can do, just run away. Alright, TM20. Alright, so that means that has to be a Voltorb right there. Pretty sure I've seen TM24 for it. It's Gust. Okay. All these items I don't want to use. I just want to sell. Literally, I just want to get money so I can buy items at the end of the game. Whatever, I'm gonna get a legendary right here. No, that's a. Oh, I already knew. What? Well, it's both birds! It's both birds. Fuck. Aw, oh, Vulpix, I could have Firestoned it and evolved it instantly. And if it packed in a good moveset, then I probably could have just picked it up right then and there. This has to be an item. There's no way. Fuck. A Pidgeotto? Well, that would have been able to evolve instantly. Alright, what's this? This has to be an item. TM36. This place has a treasure trove of TMs. Not good ones, though. Mega Punch. Of course, Daryl wants to learn it, even though his moveset is fine. You know what, if we bump into a situation where, I mean, he could be our strength user. To be perfectly honest, Swift isn't very good anymore. I mean, honestly, I could update Stomp and Swift to be, uh... An X accuracy. Fuck you. Just fuck you. Alright. Propels effect wore off. Okay. Well, that means I don't want to look at my fucking gym badges. <laughs> I don't want to look at my badges. Another protein. Alright, well that's pretty much $10,000 I'm sitting on right now. Okay, we're almost at Zapdos. We're almost at it. Or what was originally Zapdos, but could be something different entirely. Alright, this has to be a Voltorb. Yeah. A Magna- No! Solar! I would have liked Solar. I actually like him. Alright, there it is. Okay, so before we fight this legend, we're gonna save the game because only you can prevent lost save data, as per the usual. And we are going to talk to it. It actually is Zapdos! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy god! Okay, yep, yeah, Master Ball! Get over here, please! Please, Master Ball! Woo! That's a Mewtwo! It made the Zapdos sound effect! I didn't know they didn't edit the sound effects! Okay, well, we have Mewtwo now. All right, Mewtwo's the genetic Pokemon. It was created by a scientist after years of horrific gene splicing and DNA engineering experiments. Uh, like in the Pokemon... Or, or, oh, no, this thing is my my guy, Barfajon. This guy needs to be on the team. You want to know why? You want to know why this thing needs to be on the team? Because him and Hentai Man can be together once again. I and mean, I know he's a rock type. I already know he's a rock type. So, uh, Jugs, get ready to get kicked off the team, my girl. Because <laughs> the thing crippling Jugs is her level. And that's the only thing that's hurting her right now, is her level. Apart from that, probably would have picked her up, to be honest. Okay. Anyway, we're gonna deposit Jugs. But, I mean, it's because Barfajon's right on level with everyone else. It's pure rock. Okay. Double Slap, Rock Throw, Super Fang, and Bug Club. I mean, let's be honest, I have a bunch of TMs. 
I do have like a crap load of TMs in the freaking PC. I mean, because if this thing can learn Rock Slide, then it's over. It's over. It's just Rock Slide. You're done. Even with just Rock Throw, we can do a whole shite load of damage. Okay, so... Oh, I can deposit the secret key, too. We're going to deposit both... We're going to sell off both proteins. We don't need the proteins. Uh, X accuracy. I don't need the X accuracy. And then... Was it Mega Punch Gust? Mega Punch Gust. Barrier. And... Clamp. Alright, we're going to look at all these to see if Barfajan can learn it. She's not able to learn anything at the moment. Gust, he's gonna learn this. Nope, only Bukaki can. Okay, why not? <laughs> Damn, his his TM compatibility sucks. His TM compatibility is awful. He can't learn anything. Well, there you go, we used one of our Master Balls, which, in hindsight, did come in helpful. I mean, because I was not gonna lose a fucking Mewtwo. Let's be honest, I was not gonna lose a Mewtwo. Like, do you think I would sit there throwing Pokeballs all day at a Mewtwo? That, that, that's not gonna happen. Okay. There you go. 177 health. What are its stats looking like, actually? Wow, it's defensive and it's speedy. Okay. I know I can definitely get rid of Double Slap. Super Fang is actually really good for encounters. Weirdly enough, I think Mewtwo might actually be a better encounter on the dog meat is. I just like dog meat because of the type coverage, especially because he's ghost type. So I'll keep dog meat on the team, even though he is kind of irrelevant because of Barfajon now. But yeah, Barfajon has risen from the grave, which means him and Hentai Man can. Let, let, let's 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 do this. Let's let's do this. Hold on. Yeah, let's do this. They're friends once again. This is. Eerily similar to the other extreme randomizer I did, but with a whole lot less bu uh, bloodshed. But, okay. So I think what we're gonna do before we fight Sheffrey to finish off the episode, because we gotta fight Sheffrey, and then next episode's gonna be the finale, because I'm gonna go through Victory Road and the Elite Four. So that one's just gonna be like a giant friggin' episode. But I can't do that because I need to grind first. So I'll probably be like level 60 something and then just try to get as many levels as I can during the Elite Four. Anyway, we're gonna be depositing the secret key. We do not need the secret key anymore. So there you go. Um And we are gonna be withdrawing as many TMs as we can carry. As many TMs as we can carry. And we need uh, to grab HMO4 because now we need a new strength user. We need a new strength user. There we go, TM07. We still have our elixirs and our ethers and whatnot. There you go. Where is HMO4? Let me just grab HMO4 right away. Just so I don't have to, you know, fight tooth and nail for it. And also I can buy TMs if I really do need TMs. Okay, so that's almost all the TMs on our back. So, guillotine. Well, that, that's a strange amount of Pokemon that can learn guillotine. Uh, bone meringue? Uh, okay, that's a weird compatibility. Low kick? Oh, wait, 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 I'm looking at the wrong name. I'm looking at the bottom where he used to be. Even then, that's not him, right? No. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, I'm betting we're gonna be spending like 10 minutes looking at fucking TM compatibility. Body Slam? Body Slam is a move I want to teach. The Conflict. The Conflict. Okay. That's a contender. I want to give him that. Lick? At this point, yeah, I think Super Fang is gonna be much more, more useful than Nightshade. And Lick actually gets the gosh dang boost. So, Nightshade, you served us well for the longest time, but, uh... Super Fang is basically just 
a better version, to be perfectly honest. Alright. So, wait, strength? I mean, honestly, he doesn't need double slap. I mean, realistically, he only needs, like, three attack moves. So, I'd be content giving him strength. So, there you go. Uh, let's get rid of double slap. Of course. Of course, every, anybody would get rid of double slap. Yeah, also, it gets rid of double slap on Barfa John. So, there you go. Fire Blast? Oh, so close. So close, and yet so far. Fissure? Why is only Daryl can learn the Oka moves? And Lovely Kiss. Can put stuff to sleep. I mean, it's not that useful, but still. Uh. Body Slam. This is the one I'm confused for. I don't know which Pokemon to give uh, this Body Slam to. Because I want to give it to Daryl for him to have a stronger move. But at the same time, if he learned, like, Thunder Wave or Glare or something, then he could just Paraflinch whenever he wanted. Eh, yeah, screw it. We'll give it to Daryl. Just... No, you know what? No, no, no. We're gonna give it to Barvidon. Because my logic is, is that we need something for Minimizers. We need something for Minimizers. Because if somebody wants to Minimize, then... Fuck. And I have Swords Dance! So if I need to, I can just set up. Uh... Honestly, nah, we don't need bar we don't need body slam right now. So there you go. So there you go. Alright, so uh No. Alright, did, did I stick a Pokeball in here? That's the real question. No, I did not stick a Pokeball in there. Okay, good. Oh, good, Repel's effect wore off. You know what? I'm fine with that. I'm glad I didn't use that many Repel's. Anyway, it's Sheffrey time. It's time to fight the man named Sheffrey. <sighs> Sheffrey. I mean... I know it's gonna sound sad, but now I think Dog Meat himself might be a little more expendable just because of uh, Barfa John's existence. Anyway, let's do it. Oh. What Reaper? What a surprise to see you here. So you're going to Pokemon League? You collected all the badges too? That's cool. Then I'll whip you, Reaper, as a <laughs> The zombie still groans. He groans ever so. Fire fighting type. And we're going in with Daryl. This is a bad. This is this is horrible. Please. Fuck. Well, goodbye, Daryl. It's my fault. That was my fault. Hug me. Hug, hug me. Oh my god. Okay. Now check this out. High jump kick does not do any fucking crash damage. Alright, if he survives, then I'm gonna click a hyper potion. Okay. Okay, yeah. Uh, he's gonna keep spamming that. So what I'm gonna do is hyper potion Daryl uh, prematurely. Just, just so that I don't have to worry about it that much. Oh my god. That was scary. I thought I could land a horn drill on that fucker. I really thought I could. Whatever, it's fine. I did it. And Daryl got the level up. So there you go. Okay. Ghastly. Another fighting type? Fuck. Stop with all the fighting types! It's bullshit! I knew I was gonna be afraid of this guy. I, I knew. Oh, 
fuck. Oh, well, it is a fire type. So, this might have to be the time I use Barfajon. Okay, thank god, it's not the level 53. Now, thing is, am I fast enough... The, yeah, the real question is, am I fast enough to get to, uh... Hit him first? I believe so. Now, is Rock Throw strong enough? It cannot Oko a, uh... Oh! Okay. It can't Oko a Moltres. Noted. So, yeah, we need to get Rock Slide soon, Barbajon. If you're listening to me. Pinsir. It's still just a bug type. <laughs> oh, but it's not. If it can't Oko a level 43. I bless my heart and soul that this thing is not ground type. If it was ground type, I would have been so upset. Or if Barfajon was ground type. Electabuzz. I feel like it's electric. <laughs> oh! It is electric. No! Okay. Okay. You need to stop. Shit, he's the only one with electric... He's the only one with ground-type moves, though. This is a problem. Uh, I'm just gonna have to go to the, 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 the dog meat strategy again. I'm gonna have to go to dog meat again. Do it again. Sanity? What the fuck? <sighs> I don't want to risk it again. I'm just gonna have to go for a wing attack and crit. Wait, no, it's electric. Oh, God, why am I an idiot? Stop it! Stop it! No! No! I licked you! Okay. Oh, fuck me! You know what? It's fine. I forgot he had the Charizard. I'm just... I'm gonna have to go to Hentai Man and just do Surf. Regardless of what happens, I'm just gonna go to Hentai Man and hit Surf. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, please, God, no. <sighs> okay, we won. With no casualties. Okay. That was really scary. That was absolutely horrifying. What? I was just There, it's over. <laughs> Whatever, we only have to do Victory Road. That's it, that's all we have to do. It's all we have to do is Victory Road. Oh, I'm so, I'm so nervous. I'm so friggin' nervous. I'm a nervous wreck right now, trust me. I'm as scared as you are. Mm. This was... That... That was a disaster. <laughs> oh my god. Am I trying to set up an intro moment at the very end? Maybe? I don't know. I'll probably look for something funny. I mean... I guess... I guess Kumar's death, maybe. It's like the only thing I can think of to be a viable intro. Just, just to be a shock. Just to be shock therapy. Just to be, like, shock treatment. Whatever the case, we, 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 we did the thing. We did it. And even though we, we now have two deaths under our belt, still not the bloody series. Because, good God, I've had way more series than this. Like, and especially ones like, I, like, like I, I've done worse. I've dealt with worse. Anyway, I'm going to grind. I'm going to grind, and if I have enough time today, I may try to do the finale. 
I don't count on it. And I don't pray, and I don't believe that I'll have the spirit to do it. And the team I have right now really is not up to par with something I would typically bring into an Elite Four. I would want extremely high type coverage. I want like everybody to be in unique, like a unique type. Everyone to have solid moves, but at this point, there's no reasoning with this game. There is no reasoning. It cannot be bargained with. It cannot be reasoned with. And it will not stop until you are dead. But guess what? We fight back. We fight the fuck back. So next episode is going to be the finale. Even if it takes three hours to get to Sheffrey to kick his ass once again. Because I know once I get to that Charizard, I just click surf again. Hentai Man will land the final blow. Which is very fitting. Him and Barfajan get to do it together, too, in one whole episode. So there you go. I mean, I mean, because what do I have to edit? An intro, one badge, a death, and adding in a new team member. It's, it's not very hard. So what am I doing? So that's because the next episode is going to be a lot harder to tango with. Anyway, I'm rambling on. I think you know my plans for the next episode. I have been Reaper Vegas, and I will see you all next time.